What's going on guys, Bodacious Steve here. Today's video is going to be over how you can upgrade your Gambit Prime helmets. Without further ado, let's get into it. As you probably already know, the way you get most of the gear is through the Reckoning, but the helmets can only be acquired through these bounties that the Drifter has. He's got a bounty for the Invader set, the Reaper set, the Collector set, and the Sentry set. You can only hold one of these bounties at a time. Be sure to go for the first helmet upgrade that you are trying to get first in regards to the full gear set. So for instance, I went for the invader helmet just because I was going for the invader gear first. But if you are trying to get the reckoner title, definitely complete all four of these bounties within one week because they will not reset until the next week. If you're trying to get the tier three version of each of these helmets, you're going to have to do it three weeks in a row. So in order to complete these bounties, you're going to have to win four Reckoning matches while wagering a moat of the highest tier, if that makes sense. So if you have the tier three version of Reckoning unlocked, you can only complete these through tier three Reckoning. After you've done that, then you will have to do specific tasks in Gambit Prime in regards to these bounties. So after you have completed this bounty, you will get the head upgrade for whatever set that you are going for and like I said if you've already done it once then you will get the tier 2 version of the helmet if you've done it twice you get the tier 3 version but if you have never done it you get the tier 1 version yes this is a grind but this is how you upgrade the helmets hopefully this helped you out be sure to leave a like if it did subscribe for more destiny 2 content just like this and I'll catch you guys in the next video